One bin of dried fruit mix contains 28% apricots. A different bin of dried fruit mix contains 18% apricots. A new mix is made using one scoop from each bin. This mix has a mass of 600 grams and contains 25% apricots. What was the mass of dried fruit in each scoop? Bin 1 contains 28% apricots, and bin 2 contains 18% apricots. If you look closely at the illustrations, you can see that the concentration of orange apricots in bin 1 is slightly greater than the concentration in bin 2. We make a new mix by taking a scoop from bin 1 and a scoop from bin 2. We don't know what the mass of each scoop is, but we do know that our final mix has 25% apricots. Let's call the mass of dried fruit from bin 1 x, and the mass of dried fruit from bin 2 y. The mass of our mix is already given to us, it's 600 grams. We can write our first equation, x plus y equals 600, since the combined mass of the scoops must be 600 grams. When we get a scoop of dried fruit from one of the bins, the mass of apricots within that scoop can be found by multiplying the percentage by the mass of dried fruit. The mass of apricots pulled from bin 1 is 0.28x. The mass of apricots pulled from bin 2 is 0.18y. In our 600 grams of dried fruit mix, the mass of apricots is 25% of 600, or 150 grams. The mass of apricots from scoop 1 plus the mass of apricots from scoop 2 must equal 150 grams. We can use substitution to solve this problem. In the first equation, isolate x. Substitute 600 minus y for x in the second equation. Multiply 0 0.28 through the brackets. Collect terms with y on the left side and constants on the right side. This gives minus 0 0.10y equals minus 18. Divide both sides by minus 0 0.10. This gives y equals 180. Plug the y value of 180 into either equation. We'll use x plus y equals 600. Plug in 180 for y as shown in the animation. Solving for x gives 420. The scoop from the first bin was 420 grams, and the scoop from the second bin was 180 grams.